Beautiful Librans, it's Kimmy Chantress here from Sydney, Australia. I hope you guys are doing super well. Here to do your weekend warrior reading for the 30th of September, 1st of October 2023. Part of my voice, I have laryngitis. But I wanted to get these out before the weekend for you guys. So I've already pre-shuffled and the overall energy from the animal tarot cards is the high priestess. So this is the owl and it's saying this is a time to pause and reflect, not to take action. Trust in your spiritual gifts as nothing is hidden from your divine intuition. So what this is telling me with the, the angel number two, it's a symbol of your soul mission, your divine life purpose that you have in life. Okay, So it may symbolize trust, faith and love. And your angels may be sending you this number just to be sure how patient you are. Okay, they have prepared something very good for you, but you have to wait a little bit. Now, very soon, there's going to be many opportunities that's going to appear by your side and you will come to realize how happy you will be. Now, if these angels uh, are sending you a message, it's it's definitely got to be something good this weekend and you're a definitely blessed person and you deserve the best things in your life here, Libra. Now, it's also important to mention that it is also um, a symbol of diplomacy and adaptability. So you have to believe in yourself and your abilities because it's the only way to create something important in your life. So let's see what the Lenormand cards have to say. We have the woman. So this could be you, Libra, or someone that's important in your life. We have the lily and we have... The sun now, um, the lily is definitely something that happens slow. Uh, the sun is about success and feeling happy. It's a Leo energy. So what this could be um, is this is about a woman who's sensual. She's now sexually active, passionate, very enticing. And this woman's attractive, okay? She's artistic. Um, but she takes her time. Now, she also enjoys the arts. So it could be poetry, dancing, music, music or painting. She has a sunny side to her. She's warm. She's very easygoing. And she broadcasts something very strongly. Now, she is a person that's keeping up her appearances. And this is about uh, the virtue of shared joy because of lack of envy. Now, finding great joy in a frugal lifestyle, doing things in order to become more popular, okay? Now, my advice to you, Libra, this weekend is you are someone who lives frugally, but a little bit of a goody two-shoes, but you must do the right thing, Libra. Be patient, just like the angels are telling you, and, um, you know, be able to adapt in a way that you have to with the angel number two. So, you know, it, remember you're very blessed and you also deserve something beautiful in your life. So don't just do something because you want to keep up with others. Do it because it's coming from the heart and you know it's the right time, you know it's with the right person. So this could be talking about a woman who's a virgin who hasn't, actually had an uh, intimate relationship yet with somebody. It could be with an older man too uh, who's experienced. But you want it to be the right time. You want it to be with the right person. So definitely um, be patient. And uh, maybe this is the right timing this weekend for you, Libra. So whoever this is meant to go out to, uh, sending blessings your way and lots of love. Okay. Bye for now.